play a game right now. Yes, you watching this video. I want you to guess which class of people you fit into. You see, there are two classes of people on this planet right now. The first one creates the rules, the second class follows by those rules. One of the classes leads, the other class follows. And one of the classes actually controls the future of humanity whilst the others wait on the sidelines. Take a guess as to which class you fit into. The scary thing is, you don't have a choice. I'm about to tell you something about your life that may potentially make you angry. Despite what you've been told, the rules of our lives are controlled by a handful of wealthy families and corporations that have us all trapped in their own web of control. Aren't convinced? The richest person in the entire world is the founder of Amazon, Jeff Bezos. His warehouses are said to be like prisons. He kicked nearly 2,000 Whole Foods employees off health insurance when Amazon purchased the chain and spent $1.5 million trying to buy a Seattle City Council election after a city councillor suggested Amazon pay their taxes. And we're not done. Billionaire Gina Reinhart was born into wealth, inheriting a lucrative mining company. She told people who complained of income equality that they should spend less time drinking or smoking and socializing and more time working. And while she was earning $300 per second, she gave a speech saying Australia's economy was becoming less competitive because African countries could pay miners just $2 a day. Even many of the companies that you shop from every single day are part of this greater agenda. You might think that you were shopping from dozens of good and sustainable companies, but almost all of them are now owned by the same mega corporations. 90% of our news comes from the same six companies. Almost all of our investment banking is controlled by the four big banks. Even our commercial food products come from less than a dozen different big box corporations. Chances are you haven't been told this before. And there's a reason for that. It's estimated that the world's 2,153 billionaires have more wealth than the 4.6 billion average people on this planet combined. The world's richest 1% control 44% of the entire world's wealth. Just as systems around the world cater to the rich and the well-connected, it's not uncommon for white-collar business crimes to receive more slaps on the wrist whilst others are thrown in jail for not paying parking tickets. So while people like you and I are held accountable for our actions, there are then global elites that can go through their lives doing as they please without any repercussions. Now, I am all about wealth creation and building your dream life. Finding the success that you deserve is a good thing. However, the deck is stacked against you. And the crazy thing is, is that if you don't know the deck is stacked against you, there is nothing you can do about it. That's why I'm here having this conversation with you today. The challenges we are facing today with a global pandemic and economic crisis has made this divide more dangerous and pronounced than ever. What kind of world do we live in where some people get to hoard resources while others don't even have a roof over their head or access to medical care? This dynamic is so toxic because it crushes the potential of the vast majority of people in this world. We need to reimagine what this world can and should look like. We need to take back our power from the elite who are all too happy with the status quo. We should all have access to wealth building tools and we should all be held accountable to the same set of rules. To escape this web, we have to change our behavior. And the truth is, we have so much more power than we even realize right now and that is what they are terrified of. And only we have the power to stop this. Will you commit to taking this first step with me today? We need to break through the noise and actually take our power back. 
I'm Regan Hillier. Thank you so much for watching this video. I truly believe that we can together stop being puppets of the rich and the powerful, and we can actually start directing the power back to the people. Please share this video if it's impacted you. Please join this movement. I believe in you, and I know that together we can claim our power back. Thank you so much for watching.